Hi, welcome. I'm Gary Geisler, one of your technical solution architects for Cisco Plus Secure Connect. Today, we're going to look at the endpoint posture profile. This is the profile I'm going to enforce for users attempting to access my private applications over the browser. So let's get into it. We're going to see we have a couple profiles already built. Let's show you what it looks like to build one from the ground up. In the upper right hand corner, I'm going to hit add profile. I'm going to give that profile a significant name, whatever it means to me. In here, I'm going to be able to choose the operating systems, the actual operating systems of the machines I want to be able to access the service, say Windows and Mac only. I have mobile options in there if I like. I can also choose the version of the operating systems where available too. I have the ability to customize a grace period for compliance with the component as well. I can choose the types of browsers that can be chosen. Maybe I only want Safari and Chrome on the actual devices to be able to access. All other browsers that are not selected are automatically disqualified. They won't be able to access the private application. I can also do the same thing as I could with OS version. I can choose the version of the operating system and choose a grace period. Lastly, I have my locations. These are actual geolocations from which your users could access a service. So I could do an entire region, say choose Americas. I could open that up and choose specific countries if I wanted to, say just the United States or Canada or what have you, choose that. And any country that's not selected would not be able to access the private application. Hit review and save. I have all of my options to review and I'd hit save to save that policy. There is one more step to actually apply the posture profile to a browser access policy. I can see here in my top row, I have a couple access policies I'm applied to. The bottom row does not have any rules currently applied. We'll explore that in a future video. Thank you so much for your time and we hope you join us again.